Okay. Ah. God damn it. I saw it as it was happening. Uh. Okay. That was very good run. It just okay. Um God. Anubis was in a terrible spot. Oh, that hurt. That one hurt. I had 50 bombs without killing any shopkeepers. That, that was the power of the level 1 Matic. get up there without using a bomb. This. Oh wait. Never mind. Another crate here. I shot that spider. Bomb, so I don't have to buy a bomb box if I see it too early. Uh, it's worth a rope. Got the compass. I got climbing gloves now. Yes, since I only have three rope. myself I have the climbing gloves. Oh, 12 bombs. Another very good starting crate. don't have that much, but I do have the gloves and, uh, compass. Compass is pretty much essential, in my opinion, for, uh, the ice caves. Triple kill. Especially if there is a... Especially if it's a criminal run. The angry shopkeepers. did not I did not see coming. The news is we're making a decent amount of money. Bad news is I don't think it's gonna be enough without some extra some 
extra circumstances. What I really want to see is a snake pit or a dark level next. Oh, except we don't have the eye yet either. Scratch that, I don't want a dark level. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, game. Confirmation that we didn't miss the chest is always good. Hey. Sorry, damsel Dottie, I don't think you're dying out of this one. I don't think there's a way to get without a bomb. Luckily we have 22. Uh oh. I have a kitty crawling into my lap as we speak. Hi! Hi baby! Aw. He's just sleeping on my lap now. Okay, 32,000 gold plus gloves plus compass is pretty good um, for not having any special circumstances. Problem is, if this is a floor one black market, I'm not going to be able to get enough. Unless I get really lucky. I don't hear it yet. Pretty sure it was not this floor. What I'm going to do though is waste a few resources on purpose. Oh, and I don't have paste. Okay, that's the big one. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna waste some resource resources on purpose, just so I can, uh, quote-unquote, get the dot and get this chest. But I'm really... Okay, not the dot. Uh, what I'm really interested in is apparently this bomb box. Um, what I'm really interested in is seeing if there was a black market over here, and I don't think there is. So it is time to go. Fifty A even. That is great. Anything else is going into primarily paste and then bombs. Uh, maybe an extra rope at. Okay, 
there's a lot of traits here. Makes me pretty happy. I would just prefer to not take take the chance. Okay. That way. Uh, can't think to just bring me down here. Are bombs to fuel my addiction? The geography of this level is making me very nervous. Um, I know I'm spending a lot of bombs here. But it will be worth it if... I'm able to buy a lot of stuff as a result. At the black market. Bad news is we have to find the Black Mart at this level, or else I'm gonna be pretty upset. Because this is an excellent run. Seven health, even. Uh, I do not like this. Paste. Oh my gosh. Um. Very happy about this. And I can even buy this many bombs. Um, bad news is I don't hear the black market. So I better hear titting when I go to the... the left here. Okay. Oh, I see it. Man, what a terrible Black Market spawn, though. Oh, we're out. Jundle is pretty nerve-wracking. Um, we just have to make sure not to do anything stupid here. Okay, 
we have our compass, we have paste, uh, we have climbing gloves, so we have 50 bombs, which, good lord, um, glasses in case it's a night level, a dark level, I'm actually gonna buy, so that's gonna be kind of a weird buy, for, I think, um, should've lit down to see those more bombs, um, cool. Oh! I got so lucky. I actually got so lucky, okay. I think it's- I think we just head out, right? Fifty bombs? Yeah. Okay, um, I don't have vertical mobility, so that is why I'm missing this run. And, and I say vertical mobility, I mean, uh, cape jetpack. Alright, let's actually kill this guy. I think you can jump boost with the uh, freeze ray as well. Wow, I didn't know that. Okay. I don't want to see what's over there at all. Okay, we need to look for the uh, oh, I had. on the Moai head yet, but I am gonna see about making some sacrifices. Uh, cause there's a pretty high likelihood, as I was just about to say, that I get cape, or even jetpack. Um, and there's the head. Okay. We can make a lot of things happen on this level. Uh, anything now is probably gonna kill me in one shot, so I will take the Kapala. I forget what's next. I think it might just be, yeah, reinvigorated. But more health. I can sacrifice myself. To Tali here. That would be a gangster way to go. Okay. Oh. That's terrible. Oh, that was... If I had waited... Oh my god. 
I almost just spawned on the ghost. <laughs> that would have been a terrible one. Okay, I have shoe spikes. So I don't need to worry about to worry about ice. Okay. Do I want the pitcher's mitt? I actually do. I want the pitcher's mitt so I can chuck bombs at Olmec. Um, now I have all eight. No, what am I missing? Um, I think this is all eight. I think if I had sacrificed something to Tali now, I would get a jetpack. Um, there might be another normal item I'm missing, but I don't know what it is off the top of my head. Oh! Oh! Jesus! <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> Once again, should not be living in this earth for anymore. God, what a heartbreaking way to go that would have been. I got scared from that bomb. I didn't think I set it off. Okay. Um. Not mess around here. Oh, that's a dead dog. Set off the thing. I okay, don't want to mess with the thwomps at all. Okay, I've almost blown myself up in like three different times in the last like 30 seconds. Once again, not even gonna mess mess around. Got the scepter. Uh, City of Gold right there. Nice and easy. Any immediate crates? No, not even gonna do anything. Not even gonna try for the mummy glitch. Um, I've died to the mummy glitch before. I guess it's not even a glitch, but... I thought I was dead right there. Alright, let's do this. Oof. 
Okay, this is actually... Oh. Uh, actually perfect, apparently. Okay, that set off the trap. Exit is right there. Um, should be pretty easy. Okay. Alright. Out of the City of Gold. Crap ton of bombs. Even though I've been spending them a lot, I think I am getting them back right here. do it for the money. Okay, we're in hell. For the <laughs> second time tonight. Not gonna mess around. I'm gonna take things nice and slow. This is not... Okay. Find a safe place. That was not safe. Did not expect that Sachibus to move like that, but she did, and I shouldn't have lived. And how am I still alive at all? Jesus. That was. I should not be alive right now. At all. Okay. Another extremely I keep on getting very lucky. Okay. 
been pretty nervous, not gonna lie. Um, I'm so glad I got the pitcher's mitt. Both of you to come over here. I'll do that. Uh, there's lava. Oh, I saw that coming. I wanted to grab the rock, but this spiky trap would have gotten me, so that is why I did not. Um. Good lord. Alright, Yama. I have Vlad's amulet, so I can't burn to death. what to do here. Is that it? Oh my god. Okay, thank god for that. Oh my god, I did it. I don't want to say I did it yet, because I've been in this exact situation before. Get okay, away from me, vampire. Um. I'm not gonna be greedy. Oh my god, I did it. Oh my god, I did it. Oh my god. Ernie is its own reward. Damn straight. Ah, uh, I cannot wait for Spelunky 2. Hell yeah. Oh my god. I... Oh... Felt kinda weird just throwing bombs at him off screen, but... I tried the other way first, and died three times to him already, so... Oh... Let's see... Final store... 294,000. Pretty good. For me.
probably a record. I, I haven't done better than that. Ooh. Oh my god, I'm so happy. So that was my first ever time escaping hell. I don't want to say my first Yama kill because I've killed him once and died on the way out. But yeah, this makes me very happy. I wanted to, I wanted to do this before Splunky 2 released, so I wouldn't have any any uh, unfinished business lingering over my shoulders. That doesn't, of course, that doesn't mean I'm done playing this game ever. I'm sure, even with Spelunky 2 out, I'll come back to this from time to time. Maybe when I get better and try to get all the rest of the achievements, but... Wow. I'll have to, uh... Check my Steam hours after this. To see how, uh, how long this took. Yeah, I'm glad I can move on with a fresh conscience when Splunky 2 comes out. I'd been playing for a while these last, this last week, basically, um, since the game came out on PlayStation, and eventually I got good enough where tonight I was like, okay, it could literally be any run, um, so I'm gonna start recording, and. I happened to record this one. This is like maybe around 10 or 11 of the night. Um, had a few good ones. One got to hell and died on Yama already. Uh, I think two or three died in the City of Gold. Um, yeah. Kinda had a feeling it was getting close. And it turned out to be true. No jetpack, no shotgun. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm proud. Proud of my damn play tonight. Had some good moments in that run. Definitely some smart decisions. There it is. Player stats. It took one thousand four hundred and seventy-eight deaths. Killed by old age. I will say though, Vlad's amulet definitely saved me right there. And if I go on Steam, hundred and twenty-eight hours of gameplay. Ooh. All right. Now I can go up here. Select Yin, or <laughs> what am I saying? Yang. Not that I would ever play as Yang when I have custom characters. But yeah, feels really good. Uh, you may see a little montage of deaths and some best moments of tonight's runs before the kill, but otherwise I hope you enjoyed whatever I end up putting together for this video. And yeah, I will see you guys later.